Hey you guys, Catherine here, founder of Foods That Heal You and Foods That Heal You CBD. And today I'm going to be talking about CBN. We're gonna talk about what it is, some of the potential benefits. It's being recognized greatly for helping support and promote sleep as one of the biggest benefits. And then how it's been working for me. I've been experimenting with it the past week, using it in combination with CBD, using it as you know on its own. So I'm gonna go ahead and share my experience with you as well to help you maybe get a feel for um, how it, the different type of effect it might have versus CBD. Because what I'm noticing is that it's just different, okay? They're both great, it's just a little bit different. It's, it's been quite interesting to be honest. All right, so what is CBN? CBN is another cannabinoid in the hemp plant. So if you've been around with me for a while, you've seen this CBD wheel. You have CBD, it's a cannabinoid wheel. You have CBG, CB, THC, CB, all these different, CBDA, all these different cannabinoids. So CBN is another cannabinoid. And it's the result of THC aging. That's in a nutshell. Now, it does not have psychoactive effect. It is not THC. It will not cause you to fail a drug test. CBN is its own cannabinoid. It's not THC. So I just want to clarify that. All right. So, and then also the formula that we have is called REST. And I want to explain this is important too. This is CBN. There is no CBD in here. It has CBN and plant terpenes from lavender. So with CBN, one of the things they're noticing is that it works best synergistically with plant terpenes or with THC. Well, we can't t sell THC and I honestly don't want to, and I don't want that psychoactive effect, but plant terpenes, there are specific plant terpenes that can also be um, great for promoting sleep and restfulness, all right? So that's, so they work synergistically together. CBN by itself may not have much of effect. So you really want a formula that has either THC or natural occurring plant terpenes in there. All right, so that's what CBN is. Let's move on to some of the potential benefits. So like I said, what's been kind of interesting is the benefits are, they're similar. There's some common threads. CBN can help with, it's calming. It can help you relax. Uh, it can help reduce inflammation, can help calm the nervous system. So if, if you notice there, there's a lot of similar antioxidant, a lot of similar effects as what we've got in the CBD here. So what's the difference? Okay, well the difference is that CBN is kind of being touted for its sedating effect, which is why it would be more beneficial if you're having trouble getting to sleep. Uh, it's I've noticed, okay, so let's move into, so now we talked about the benefits, there's some common thread benefits, but like the like I said, the biggest difference is it's more sedating. And I'm gonna share a couple of differences I've personally noticed in addition to that. So the first time I tried it, the first night that I tried it to see how it would affect my sleep is I just used two full droppers of the CBN by itself, which it has the plant terpenes in it. So I know it has that synergistic effect and I always say if one's better, two's, one's good, two's better. <laughs> it's just my logic. You only have to take one dropper full. I took two because I really wanted to experience the, the effect. I wanted to really be able to identify the effect of it by itself. What I noticed was real interesting was I just, I couldn't focus on anything. I just was really easily distracted. So anything that my racing thoughts might've been thinking about from the day, my stress, whatever, I was just like, I, I can't focus, <laughs> which is great for sleep because a lot of the reasons we can't get to sleep is because we're stressed out and we're obsessing over different things that we're, we're thinking out through the day. So that's the biggest thing I noticed right off the bat, all right? The second night I decided, huh, wonder what it's gonna, wonder what it would be like if I added to it the CBG CBD blend. And that's this one right here. So I took a dropper full of this and a dropper full of the CBN. I took these together. Really interesting. What I noticed is my nervous system immediately, I mean fast, just really calmed down. I just, it was a really interesting combination. Um, gosh, it's hard to describe. Again, with these things, you know, you really just gotta try it yourself because everybody's different. So this is my experience, but like restless leg syndrome, just wow, my legs were so calm. Not that I really have a lot of restless leg, but it, it, when I go to bed, I, I kind of kick a little bit, you know, you're shifting around trying to get comfortable. It was just like, it was just like, bam, I was just calm. <laughs> so that was a big difference that I noticed combining those. Then I decided I would go ahead and try the next night or maybe it's a couple nights later, the soft gels, which I always love 
for helping sleep through the night. So I tried the soft gels, one soft gel with a full dropper of the CPN. When I combined those two, it was more evened out for me. I, I felt like I fell asleep well and I slept deeply through the night. So my favorite combination at this point is gonna be the CBN with the soft gel. That's my favorite combination. Now I've talked to other people uh, that have been experimenting with it with me as well. And they're agreeing with the soft gel combination with the CBG or CBN. They really like that. And then my husband's been experimenting with it too. He likes the CBN by itself. That seems to be working really well for, her, for him, even sleeping solidly through the night. So my suggestion would be, if you're having trouble sleeping and you're trying to find a good combination, go ahead and get the CBN, try it by itself, try it with the other products that you have. It's, it's gonna be different, because as, as you notice, as I'm talking here, each combination that I used was a little bit different from the one before. So if you have any questions, I hope this is beneficial. I, I, I don't like to make any claims, I just like to be transparent on how it's working for me, what it is. So if you have any questions, you can join us on Facebook and I'm gonna post this on Facebook. You can ask questions below. You can email me at Catherine at foodsthathealyou.com. I would love to help you out, help you decide what might be best for you. You can check out my video training series on my Foods That Heal You CBD website and I will see you in the next video. Thanks for watching.